press the bell icon and never miss an update from ET Auto. Hello and welcome to ET Auto Analysis. We bring to you complete automotive sales and exports analysis for 2018. In 2018, automobile demand remained robust despite slowdown overcast in the last few months. Almost every segment except passenger vehicle reported strong positive growth. When it comes to market share, I must tell you that top four contributed over 82% of the entire passenger vehicle segments. Uh, Maruti Suzuki's market share uh, remained at 51%, while second uh, in the category Hyundai Motor Corporation had a slightly lower market share of 16.2%. Mahindra contributed 7.3% to the total passenger vehicle sales while Tata Motors continued to have 7% market share. Honda cars contributed 52% of the total pie size when it comes to passenger vehicle segment in 2018. If we look at 2017, uh, Maruti Suzuki had 49% market share which grew to 51%, which means 2% uh, growth in terms of market share. For Hyundai, which is the second largest, there has been slight decline because in 2017, they had about 16.4% market share. This year, they had 16.2% market share. If we move forward, uh, we'll see in terms of ranking, uh, uh, Maruti Suzuki, of course, was number one. Um, Hyundai remained at number two. Mahindra was at number three. Tata Motors fourth position, while uh, Honda cars maintained at fifth position. Sixth position was held by Toyota Kiloskan Motor. When it comes to luxury passenger vehicle segment, of course, Mercedes-Benz continue to remain on top for the fourth state year. Uh, the sales for Mercedes grew by marginal 1.38% to 15,330 units. Uh, BMW saw a strong growth of 13% at 9,800 units, while entire uh, passenger vehicle luxury segment remained at 40, a little over 40,000 units with a growth of 3.47%, which is not really big looking at the uh, low base that we have. If we talk about the industry expectation, uh, we spoke to a couple of top industry leaders in luxury segment. They felt that the year 2019 is also not going to be very bullish for uh, luxury uh, passenger vehicles. They will remain in the vicinity of 3 to 5% this year too. When it comes to two-wheeler segment, it posted a strong double-digit 12.8 percent growth in 2018 compared to 2017. The growth comes after overcoming the various hurdles such as Kerala floods, insurance cost becoming higher because of the new norms uh, that was announced a few months ago. Then other factors like high interest rate, high fuel cost. Despite all that, two-wheeler segment has reported a strong overall growth. Uh, but last three months has not been so great for two-wheeler also. If we talk about market share, Hido Motor Corp commanded the largest market share of uh, 36% and uh, Honda Motorcycle's market share stood at 27.2%. Uh, then the other big uh, market share were uh, cut by TBS Motor which had 14.6% while Bajaj commanded 11.2% uh, of market share. Royal Enfield had 3.9% market share. Suzuki Motorcycles maintained a 2.9% market share. Yamaha had 3.7% market share in calendar year 2018. If you look at the previous year market share, uh, I tell you that uh, Hero Motor Corp was a bit uh, on higher side by 36.7% in 2017 compared to 36.2%. Number two, Honda Motorcycles also sh uh, witnessed a contraction in 2018 because in 2017, they had a market share of 28.5% compared to 27.2% this 2018 market share. If you talk about Yamaha also had a 4.1% market share in 2017 which reduced to 3.7% market share in 2018. Total of commercial vehicle sales experienced a strong growth of 27.28% in 2018 compared to 2017. 2018 the total sales grew above 1 million unit compared to about 7.8 lakh uh, units sold in the previous year. If we talk about market share, obviously Tata Motor has the largest market share of 44.2% uh, in 2018 compared to 
43.5 percent market share in the previous year. If you talk about the second largest uh, uh, manufacturer or second largest market share was held by Mahindra and Mahindra uh, at 22.6 percent in F into a calendar year 18 compared to 25.7 uh, percent market share in 2017. If we talk about Ashok Leyland, which is the third largest commercial vehicle manufacturer in India, had 16.8 percent market share in 2018 compared to 18.7 percent market share in the previous year. If we look at the top seller in the commercial vehicle man space, most of them had a contraction in their market share as the new players had cut their pie. Overall, three-wheeler units are sold. Uh, about uh, 71, 7 lakh 17,590 units were sold. Total of 7 lakh 17,590 units of three wheelers were sold, recording a growth of 30.94 percent. If you talk about market share, Bajaj Auto continued to command of the over 58.5 percent of the three wheeler market share in India, uh, uh, followed by Piaggio, which has a 23. 4% market share in three-wheeler space in 2017. If we talk about 2018, the market share uh, uh, continued to be uh, dominated by Bajaj Auto, which had 54.2% market share, which means so Bajaj Auto lost 4% market share in 2018 compared to 2017. While the second uh, uh, in um, biggest uh, seller in three-wheeler space, Piaggio, had a 26.3 percent market share in 2018 compared to 23.4 percent market share in the previous year. This was about calendar year 2018 and now I would like to put some of the uh, sales forecast. Our point of view is that passenger vehicle segment will grow between 3 to 4 percent. We cannot expo expect a double digit or strong growth in FY20. 20 because of various reasons that we have already been uh, tracking. Commercial vehicle sales also will grow between 8 to 10 percent, while two wheeler sales will remain between 10 to 12 percent. Three wheeler sales will remain between 7 to 9 percent. That's the forecast for FY 2020. I would like to bring in my colleague Dipanshu Tomar who will share some of the key takeaways from calendar year 2018. Dipanshu, we have seen if we talk about top exported, exported models from India, we see that uh, top three were made in India but American cars. Uh, we don't see any of the Indian car makers uh, product uh, featuring in the top 10 exported cars in 2018. Uh, what do you have to say on that? So it's interesting to know, you know that uh, Hyundai which has been the second uh, car manufacturer in India which has been selling top three cars like Elite, I-20, Grand, I-10 and uh, Creta have also three positions in top ten exported cars, you know, and this is a very interesting fact. Okay, Dipanshu, you had culled out some of the inter interesting facts that you uh, found out in calendar year 2018. Can you share with our viewers and readers? So. Uh, some of the interesting facts that you know I came out with was you know uh, if we talk about the production per day in last year we almost produced 11,000 units of passenger vehicles per day and compared to the two wheelers which were around 68,000. Top four car makers Maruti, Hyundai, MNM and Tata have accounted over 80% 80, 80 of market share. Similar is the case with the two wheelers you know Hero and uh, Honda motorcycles they have accounted over 63% market share. So those were the some key takeaways for 2018 wish you a very happy new year 2019 and wish you a very good business coming. <laughs>